Nagana's justice system has generally been described by many as slow, with analysts making regular suggestions for reforms. This forced the judiciary to set up commercial courts in early 2000s, following assessments by the World Bank and Commonwealth Secretariat that this was warding off potential investors who feared their dispute could drag. As part of a joint news project in collaboration with the United Kingdom's Department for International Development, we are we we'll look at 14 years after the commercial courts were set up. These uh, uh, processes tend to take too long, you see it, yes, and often, of course, the reasons are not hard to uh, hazard. Private legal practitioner Martin Pebu's assessment of Ghana's justice system. It represents the views of many, including persons who have had their cases come up in court. In 2003, Chief Justice Kinsley Aqua embarked on a series of reforms. This was at a time the Commonwealth Secretariat and World Bank had described contract enforcement in Ghana's court as generally inadequate, a situation that warded off investors. The commercial courts were then set up to deal solely with such matters as a way of addressing the challenge. Eddie Jitamaklo is a private legal practitioner. The whole idea flows from the fact that time is money. So you want to resolve the dispute early so that the parties can go back and have their you know, um, um, commercial transaction. Yes. He explains how commercial disputes are different from other cases. The rules mandate that you go for a pre-trial conference. That pre-trial conference allows the parties to one and one look themselves in the face. Because the idea is maybe this commercial transaction, there were once parties, like maybe shareholding. There's a dispute involving shareholding. This is a person who, first of all, formed the company. So it's a relationship that started well, and maybe now there's a dispute. So the idea is that if you give the people the opportunity to sit down one on one, look themselves in the face, they'll be able to resolve the process quicker than to bring all these technicalities, the rules of evidence, the rules of this, you know, that strict rules and its application. He argues the reforms have improved the justice system significantly. From 2004, when um, the CI-47 came into being, relatively, relatively, if you speak to um, lawyers who practice either with the LN, uh, LN-140A, they will tell you that particular reference to the, the commercial rules have quickened the processes a bit. Most of the disputes in the advanced countries and others sometimes get settled at that level. So once we look at the rules pertaining in other jurisdictions, We'll pick it up and then we can have some of these things done. Quickly. The judicial service is expected to continue with its goal of improving the justice administration system that has so far seen ICT play a key role. Joseph Akable, Joy News, Accra.